Thought I'd forget about you guys? No way. I got you guys covered for the upcoming V-Day. Whether you're ready to pop up the question if it's your first, second, or third base, these top 10 love potions are definitely guaranteed to get you all the way. You ready for it? Let's do it. What is up, Frag Fam? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to be discussing the top 10 fragrances or love potions I'm ready to share with you guys that I think will do great for you, whether you are going on a first date, romantic situations. Any of these 10 fragrances will guarantee to give you an edge, will complement that attire and that evening wear perfectly. This is like the ultimate final accessory, the cherry on top, the icy on the cake, so to speak. Just saying. The first choice here is for the young at heart, a youngster out there, somebody who's going on the first date. This fragrance is an oriental spicy fragrance with gourmand nuances. It has a lot of vanilla, some tonka in there. It's really sweet, very appealing, and very well blended from the house of Azaro. This is Azaro Wanted by Night. I have a full review on this fragrance. It's going to pop up here somewhere. A great choice to impress or melt her heart if you play your cards right. Now, if you want to play it safe, you want a fragrance that's going to have a very sophisticated and sensual air about it, but it's also mass appealing and very universally uh, accepted, I would say go with Blue de Chanel Parfum Edition released last year around summertime. Blue Parfum is definitely going to get you smelling great and definitely make a great first impression. This fragrance is going to give off a vibe of a very well put together gentleman and somebody of fine taste. So if you want to impress her, check out Blue de Chanel Parfum. Now you guys know how much I love this fragrance right now and it's a little bit of a secret of mine. I, I always kept this in the hush hush but I'm going to share with you guys today because it's a special occasion. I know you guys want to make a great first impression so check out La Nuit de Lome. You guys know how much I like to layer. Layered with La Nuit de Lome L'Intense. These are great on their own but if you have issues with La Nuit's performance, which a lot of people do with newer formulations, this is a 2011 formulation but I know people have issues with current formulations lasting two to three hours. You want something that's going to last the whole night Night, guys, layer with this one right here, La Nuit L'Intense, which has a more prominent note of iris, which is very seductive, very sexy. You put about four sprays of this one and two on top with this guy right here. Top it off with two of La Nuit L'Intense. Guys, thank me later. Now, if she also has a sweet tooth, if she likes vanilla, this particular fragrance that I'm talking to you guys about right now came to me as a total surprise last year from the house of Coach. This is Coach Platinum, a phenomenal oriental vanilla borderline gourmand territory. It's an amazing scent. It's going to pop up here somewhere if you want to see the full review in depth. It's one that's a no joke. If she has a sweet tooth, if she likes vanilla, oriental kind of scent, a little bit spicy, this fragrance lasts a long time. It lasts all night. It's going to get you smelling great as well. So check this out if you haven't. Coach Platinum, a great one from last year. Now, if you're not on the budget, you want to splurge a little bit, this particular fragrance is just spectacular. You can get a decan of it, do whatever you got to do. This is what I like to call the Red Hot. This is original Santal from the House of Creed. A lot of people argue and say that Mont Blanc's individual is very similar to this. Yes, they are very, very close or close cousins. I'd say the other one, Mont Blanc individual, is a little more clean, a little bit more crisp, like uh, you know, fresh, clean linens. To me, it's definitely better than Mont Blanc's individual. It's definitely better quality. It's gonna last a lot, lot longer. This particular stuff is sandalwood and cinnamon to perfection. If you guys want something seductive and sensual that's definitely gonna grab her attention from the get-go, definitely go with this one. I'm gonna caution you though, don't overspray. This could be a little bit of a powerful scent. It has that really um, attention-grabbing, head-turning kind of effect on people. I'd say three to four sprays and you're good to go for the whole evening. If you haven't yet, check out the Red Hot Original Santal from Creed. Talk about seductive. If your lady does like dessert-like fragrances, this one here will not disappoint. She's gonna wanna eat you up from the moment she smells you. Of course, I'm talking about this fragrance really has that effect on ladies. I'm talking about One Million's Lucky. That fragrance was made for that, for dating, for getting lucky, if you will. This fragrance is just absolutely bonkers. We're talking about honey, hazelnuts, it's oriental, it's got, it's got it's got some vanilla components, a little bit of a tonka going on. It's definitely a gourmand at heart. If she has a sweet tooth and likes chocolates like Ferrero Rocher, you are halfway there. If you're ready to get some attention, if you want to grab her heart and check out One Million Lucky. If you guys like my picks so far and you find this video helpful in any way, please don't forget to show your support, like this video, subscribe for more, and also don't forget to enable notification. That way you'll never miss out on future videos. Now on with the video. I'll carry on with the Valentine's theme. Nothing says Valentine's more than chocolates and roses. And I have one here for you that just embodies that element, that essence perfectly. Of course, I'm talking about Monsetta's 
Roses and Chocolate. This is a phenomenal fragrance. I've been talking about this fragrance in length since 2015. I actually wear this fragrance solely for this kind of uh, you know weather, you know when it's winter, it's cold out, romantic situations, Valentine's days. This is a perfect scent for that. If you want to embody the Valentine spirit, you want something that's going to give you that you know, essence of roses and chocolate. There's nothing better than roses and chocolate from Mancera. This is just divine, guys. Think of a Cupid's elixir. Looking for something great for romantic settings, no questions asked. Roses and chocolates it is. This next one is one of my old time favorite romantic scents. One that I wore for, I think since 2011, very heavily and always been part of my rotations in the cold weather, especially for romantic settings, evening wear. This is just seduction in the bottle. I'm talking about Dior Homme Intense. Dior Homme Intense is just an amazing cocoa iris, amazing scent, seduction in a bottle, just perfection. However, if you want to take one step further to the next level, I would say try to procure a bottle of this particular fragrance right here, Dior Homme Parfum. Dior Homme Parfum adds leather to the whole uh, already amazing Dior Homme Intense, just to me takes it to the next level. A little hard to find here in the US right now, so if you can't find this, don't despair. And this one's definitely one that's gonna get you smelling different than everybody else. So I think if you want something to give you an edge for sure, but it's very easy to get. This is not that hard to find. You can probably find this at your local you know, store. Uh, you can get this online at the Dior website, but it's definitely one that's gonna get you smelling amazing. And trust me, she'll love the way you smell. I've gotten tons of compliments from this fragrance with the opposite sex. So Dior Arm Intense, it's definitely one that you want to check out for Valentine's Day. You want to talk about seduction, no wonder why they write right in front of this fragrance here, Aphrodisiac. That's exactly what this fragrance is. This is a love potion number nine. This was actually my scent of the day on Valentine's last year. And it's been actually my scent of the day for Valentine's for the past two years in a row. You're talking about honey, spices, tobacco, uh, some cherry liqueur. I mean, my mouth just waters thinking about this fragrance. It's a great one, a little bit pricey, but if you really want to melt her heart, I would suggest check out Back to Black from the House of Killian. To me, on my top three favorite seductive fragrances of all time, period. Check this out if you haven't, because if you haven't checked this out, you're really missing out. And last but not least, most likely my scent of the day for this Valentine's Day 2019, the great Baccarat Rouge 540, a fragrance that needs no introduction whatsoever. Everybody's talking about this fragrance, making top lists everywhere. One that you must check out. If you haven't, get your nose in this one, guys. Do yourselves a favor. This stuff has something whimsical about it that's just so captivating. This is a compliment magnet. Every time I wear this fragrance, I get stopped at least three to four times. What are you wearing, man? You smell amazing. That stuff is just pure seduction for Valentine's Day. If you're looking to impress a gal or a guy, whatever you're into, Check out Baccarat Rouge 540. You're not going to disappoint. Today's actually February 10th, 2019, so you still have time to try to get these fragrances if you want to check them out. I'm going to have the link down below to my great partner, MyFragranceSamples.com, with my coupon code MAX15, which will grant you guys 15% off at checkout. You still got time. If you place your order between today and tomorrow, most likely you'll get it before Valentine's Day, before your big night. So guys, enjoy. Thanks so much for tuning in. Let me know in the comment section down below if you guys have a particular scent that you love to wear for romantic night out situations. Or if you have something special for Valentine's Day this year, please let me know in the comment section below. Let's start a little Valentine's Day conversation. Thanks for tuning in, ladies and gents. I hope you guys have an awesome Valentine's Day this year. In the meantime, smell well, enjoy your journey, and I'll see you guys in the next one.